Oh god. Is this my hair? No. Today I'm going to show you how to use QuickTime and iMovie to make upright vertical videos for your Instagram, IGTV, or Instagram stories. Stay tuned. So obviously you're going to need some footage. So once you got your footage, I go into my phone, select the clips I just took, and I airdrop them to my computer where I can work on them in iMovie. Okay, so I'm in iMovie now. Just go into my folder here, take the files I just airdrop, drag and drop them into my folder. All right. I also have an audio file that I'm going to use, downloaded it, same thing. In my downloads folder, I'm just going to drag and drop. All right, first file, going to bring it down here, put it in there. As you'll notice, it's in that landscape format. We're going to deal with having to put it into the vertical format later, unless maybe you just kind of want to look at it like this. Could always go up into this control panel here and you could rotate your file into the proper vertical position, but I just always leave it until the end anyway. Um, there's other things in here if you want to correct your highlights or shadows, uh, maybe your saturation or the white balance of your file, whatever you want. Okay, this camera stabilizer, don't really use it if you want to mute your audio. Uh, this is for speed, if you want to do some speed ramping or anything. I like that in my clips, not going to use it here. Here's if you want to put, apply some filters to your folder or to your file. Um, what do we got here? Just some information, not really that important. Alright, now it's just time to get editing. Uh, choose the choose the locations you want, just scrub through, right click, split clip, then you can just click on it and delete after. Um, this is really just up to you however you want to make it. So uh, I'll just speed this up a little bit and check back with you in a second. All right, I got a couple clips here. Let's add some transitions. Button right here, click that, and there's all sorts of ones you can choose from. You just click it and drop it in between your two clips. Play it through, little spin transition. If you don't like it, just click on it and erase it. All right, I think I'm gonna add one more clip here. Just put this one in here. Just the spot where the camera changes focus from my little guy to the dog. Clip it. Delete. Okay, it's worth noting, make sure you standard that 15 second. Uh, of course, that's not a big deal if you're making this movie for your IGTV account. But if it is for Instagram stories, it's gonna have to be under 15 seconds. All right, last thing, just gonna add an audio clip. Same thing, right clip, click it to the end here. And there you have it. Click on this project folder, add a project name. I'm gonna call this log dog. Okay, here's the log dog file we just made. Go to share project and save it out as a file. Just leave all these settings as they are. You can mess around with it. It kind of changes the file size. Yeah, but you don't want it too big because you're going to have to send it back to your phone. All right, open up in the finder and how, now we're going to get in the vertical position. We're going to open it with QuickTime. Go to edit, rotate left or right. And all you have to do is just resave it. I usually just call it the same thing. I'm going to call it log dog and add rotate on the end so I know it's back in the vertical position. Put it in the folder you want, put it in my movies folder here, click save. And there it goes, log dog rotate. I just airdrop it back to my phone, upload it to my IGTV account or Instagram story. All right, that's it. If you like this video, consider subscribing, hitting that like, leaving a comment, it all helps me out.